I'm Jamie Diaz. I'm a certified professional dog trainer. I'm the owner of Lucky Dog Training Club and Dynamite Dog Training. Today we're going to be working on barking. Barking can be very problematic for owners and the dog. So we're going to work on what you can do when your dog is an excessive barker. Oh! So we're working with Squash on his barking or not barking. So he, he, this is a learned behavior. There's different types of barking. This is barking because I'm not giving him the treat fast enough. So how are we going to fix that? What you could do is if you take the treat close to their nose, they cannot smell and bark at the same time. Quiet. Yes, you wait a couple seconds, give him that reward. I'm gonna wait till he barks again. Quiet. Good, so what you're going to do is you're going to wait longer and longer. This is only step one, because then your dog will learn to bark, to be quiet, to get a treat. This is just teaching him what those words mean. Quiet. Yes, good job, good job. The way you proof this is if your dog is barking and you say, quiet, and he actually is quiet, which he's not, then he's made the connection of the words, quiet. Yes. So right now, step one, we're teaching him when he sniffs, he hears the word quiet, he's actually quiet. And then we'll move on to the next step. All right, we're working on another technique for barking. We want to reward that quiet Squash is barking because there's another dog over there. So once he's quiet, yes. Hi, how are you? Yes, if he chooses to be quiet, he's going to get that reward. Yes, good job. Yes, good job. So again, you want to have your dog at a far enough space that they can think, but right now I'm rewarding him for not barking at, <laughs> at the other dog. Squash! Good boy! Yay! Good job! He usually barks frantically at the other dog. You want to make sure you're far enough away. He's also learned to attention bark to get what he wants. Good job. So any of those behaviors that we can reward for him, we want to. Now this is just a paint stick with some peanut butter sniffed, um, smeared on it. This is great for walks because you can reward your dog right here, but it's also a high value reward for him for the barking. So this is actually the longest kind of um, stretch we've gotten without him barking. Good job. So we're gonna continue to work, but you also just wanna make sure you diagnose what the barking is from. If it's from fear or frustration, that's a totally different plan than if it's attention barking. Thank you.